Today in Review This Thing, we're gonna review this thing, the Mossberg Patriot Predator. This is Adrian with Review This Thing. And last year, we decided we wanted to get on the seven PRC train and see what all the fuss was about. After reaching out to our friends at Mossberg, they were kind enough to let us borrow this Patriot Predator. But I will tell you, we were a little conflicted. First, we were pretty excited because we have shot and reviewed several Mossberg shotguns and loved them. But then we were also a little nervous because some of the content we had seen out there were not so complimentary about these rifles. Now we have hunted with it quite a bit and we have shot it even more. So we're ready to tell you what we think. Is it worth it or should you just pass on it like a few of those other people had said? We'll find out. Let's review this thing. We appreciate you watching our review. If you like it, make sure you click the like button. We have a brand new review every Sunday. So if you really like what we do, make sure you subscribe and click that notification bell so you don't miss anything. Let's cover all the facts. The first part is fit. I am gonna say a lot of really good things about this rifle, but in the fit section is probably not where those are. First, let's talk about length of pull. I measured it right at about 14 inches. Now I am 5'4", fairly small frame, so I prefer it to be closer to maybe 13, 13 and a half inches. You can see we weren't able to get the scope back far enough so that I could get down, good comfortable shooting position, but I always would like it to be adjustable so you can use it for smaller people, kids, or if you're taller, then you can also have that, that good long length. The next thing we talk about with fit is cheek weld. I pretty much always have a difficult time getting a good cheek weld on these hunter style stocks. Because of that, I figured out how to get a pretty good jaw weld on most rifles and be able to shoot accurately. This one also has a little piece that comes out so that you can rest your cheek against it a little bit better. But as always, I would rather have an adjustable cheek piece. And the last thing I wanna talk about with fit is reaching the trigger. The grip has a pretty long curve, so the place where you rest your three fingers is too far back for me. So I have to do the, my typical thing where I have to lean my hand forward so that I can reach the trigger. I've become pretty fond of the more vertical, I guess, precision style grips. I just feel like it's a whole lot easier for me to rest my fingers comfortably and make a good, steady, easy squeeze on the trigger. Having said all of that, Robbie, who is about 5'10", average build, says it fits him perfectly, so he would give it a much higher score than me on fit. But if you're a smaller frame person like me, you might be very similar. So I am gonna give fit a four out of five. Now is the Mossberg Patriot Predator as advertised. The main thing Mossberg advertises is that it has unmatched accuracy and dependability. Like I said, at first we were pretty hesitant to try out this rifle, Ammo ain't cheap, especially in 7PRC, so we didn't want to waste a bunch of money on a rifle that wasn't going to shoot good grips. But I have to tell you, we were blown away. Pun intended. In our first video, I shot the absolute best group I have ever shot in my life out of anything. Even $1,500 rifles. Then we shot one of the Federal loads. Our results were way better than we expected after seeing those other videos. Plus, Robbie took it out hunting a few times and killed three does. One of them was even at 220 yards. Two of them dropped right in their tracks and the other one probably didn't go more than 60 yards. So as far as accuracy and dependability, it's been pretty doggone solid for us. The next thing they advertise is their smooth self-adjustable trigger. It is advertised to shoot between two pounds and seven pounds. Right now, this one measures just under two pounds, but that trigger gauge could be a little off. I will tell you that it is a super smooth trigger. It does have a trigger safety, which I thought was gonna be a little weird at first, but after a while, I just kinda got used to it and didn't even notice it anymore. So I would say the Mossberg Patriot Predator does exactly what they say it should do. So. We're gonna have to give, as advertised, a five out of five. After watching this video, you decide you like what you see, head over to our website, reviewthisthingtv.com, where you'll find a lot of various links. And shopping through those actually helps us out because we earn a small commission at no cost to you whatsoever. Now on to construction and durability. This 7PRC has a 24 inch barrel that is fluted to help cut weight and dissipate heat better. And it's also threaded, which I absolutely love. In our ammo testing videos, we put the Area 419 Hellfire brake on it, which makes a huge difference in mitigating that recoil. And when hunting, we had the Gunworks 6 suppressor on it, 
The bolt is spiral fluted and with this oversized bolt handle, it makes it really easy to work the action. Especially after cleaning, lubing, it works really, really well. It is a bit clunkier in there. It's a little looser than some of the others, but we haven't had any issues with it cycling around. On this version, the thread protector barrel and bolt and handle are all Cerakoted to help with abrasion resistance and just longevity of this rifle. It does come with a pick rail, saves you some money, makes mounting the scope super easy. I have some trouble loading from the top, especially when you have a 20 MOA rail on there. I very much appreciate that it has a basically flush mount magazine and plenty of room in front of the lever to be able to take it out. The safety, like a lot of other rifles, is just a pretty easy to work, two position thumb safety. And then we have this strata pattern on this synthetic stock. Even with this synthetic stock, it's actually a little bit more heavy duty than you might expect. Now it isn't gonna be the same quality as maybe some of those higher end rifles, but I am actually pretty impressed with how sturdy it feels. It comes out of the box weighing just over six and a half pounds, with our current setup using this Athlon Neos 3 to 9 by 40 scope, we're weighing just over eight pounds unloaded, making it a breeze to carry through the woods and hunt with. So as far as construction and durability, I'm going to take a little bit off because the bolt isn't quite as smooth and of course the stock isn't quite as fancy either. But you are also not going to pay near as much for this gun as those other ones we're talking about. But we'll get to that in just a minute. So having said that, I'm gonna give construction and durability a 4.7 out of five. Now onto testimonials and reviews. Overall, the Mossberg Patriot gets really good scores online, but I did find a few complaints, so I'll tell you those. A few people actually said when they received theirs, it did not have a complete rail, but was split. This is the one that came on ours, so I don't know if that's maybe a new development. If yours did that, I'd reach out to customer service and see what they have to say. One person reported one drawback they felt was that you can't lock the bolt in a closed position. Their thought was that potentially when you're walking through the woods with it, if that oversized bolt handle were to get hung on a tree or something, it might throw it open and fall. And then if it's loaded, you're going to eject a ram. I've never actually thought of that because most of the guns that I have hunted with are this way, but thankfully that's nothing I've had happen yet. And then finally, people complained they weren't able to get accurate groups. We've already covered that. That is not something we had any issues with at all, except for that one load. So, you know, I'm gonna tell you the score that we found. So testimonials and reviews, it gets a 4.9 out of five. Now, finally, should you buy this thing? From our experience, I would say it's pretty much a no brainer. Now, I know I started out this review talking about all the things I didn't like about the way that this rifle fits, but we were obviously able to make accommodations and even at this price point, I could switch out this stock if I really wanted to. MSRP for this version is 636, but retail seems to be around 539. They do have a blued barrel version that retails for about 450. If you are looking for a very budget-friendly rifle that we have seen be very accurate, at least out to 100 yards, then I can't think of a good reason why you wouldn't take a look at the Mossberg Patriot. I would say, should you buy this thing? Five out of five. Hey, thanks for watching our Mossberg Patriot Predator review video. While you're here, like it, share it, comment. Make sure if you haven't, you go ahead and subscribe. Head to our website, reviewthisingtv.com and sign up for our newsletter. Check us out on Instagram, Facebook, TikTok, and Twitter. And check out our Amazon store. Thanks for watching.